What's up? What's up? What's going on, guys? It's your host and Elizabeth DFS. I'm here for DraftKings, FanDuel, NFL DFS for week eight. All right, guys. Uh, this is my section segment three where I'm going to give you guys my selections, my five players. So let's go ahead and jump to it, guys. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys are happy that NBA is back. We have base player of baseball, NFL going on is uh, halfway through, and then we have the NBA. That's the sports guy. I had a great night tonight, so I'm ready to go ahead and give you guys my selections, and I'm feeling good about this slate, man. My selections for week Eight, and you guys can see who is going to be on my thumbnail. All right. By the way, that, that's my team, too. They're doing really good. Five and one. All right, let's jump to it. We are going to start with the quarterback position, guys, with the quarterback. For DK, I'm going with Watson. All right. This week, I love Watson, man. It's a bounce-back game after this game against the Colts, and I expect him to come and at least go back to what he's been doing the couple of weeks before, so I'm expecting 25, at least 25 fantasy points in that game. Watson is my guy. Give him maybe, and I think the guy to pay him with is not the guy you guy might be thinking. I mean, you know, a lot of people, of course, they're gonna go with Hopkins. Oh, but me, I'm not, I don't even need to say his name. You guys already know what I'm talking about. But me, I'm going with Kiki. I'm pairing him with Kiki. All right, Kiki is the player I'm going to pair him with. I think Kiki is going to go for a long touchdown this week. And I cannot wait because this team right here is going to go straight to my melee maker. All right, so Kiki and Watson, I pair them up. Hopefully, Hey, Kiki, I don't want you to get a running touchdown this week. I want you to get a passing touchdown because I pair you up with my quarterback. So, Kiki, I expect you to get at least seven, eight targets this week and hopefully at least catch five of them and turn one of them for a long touchdown. My running back, guys, is going to be the most popular running back. But, hey, this guy all week, he's busy. He is busy. He is busy. <laughs> All week, this guy has been, been getting all he can handle, all right? So, I'm, you guys already know what I'm talking about. Yes, not, no, not this guy. Yes, this guy. And I'm talking about Fournette, all right? Fournette is the guy I'm talking about here. Fournette is the guy I'm talking about, not CMC, all right? CMC. I don't like his prize this week, man. I'm going to try my best to stay away from him. But you have to at least play him in a, one of your lineup because CMC has been going up. So you don't want to be one of the guys that didn't play him in at least one of 10% of your lineup. But Fournette to me is the guy to play against that New York Jets team. All right. For my tight end, I'm going to go with Engram. 5.3, this is the bounce back game for me. To me, Engram is the most talented, to me, the most talented tight end in this list. And Engram is the guy I'm going with. One week removed from his injury since he came back, I expect him to bounce back to a better game this week. And my order, receiver is yes guys you see him on the cover and that is john brown john brown i expect him to have a great game this week that's another guy that might be able to get me another long touchdown against that philly team they are just bad they cannot cover anybody and john brown is the perfect player to go up against this team. So those my five players are Watson, Fournette, Kiki, John Brown, and Engram. All right. So before I get off that team, let's go real quick to another wide receiver. 
Let's see. Your stun game is a 425. I like the time too. So you go to use stun. Yes, a lot of people are gonna go to Kenny Steel. Alright. Another guy I actually really really love in this game is Williams. I just wanna let you guys know the only reason I didn't go with him is the fact that I don't know if he is going to play for sure. So if you guys can start that team, that is a good that is a good way to start that team. Alright. You can have Williams in there. Either Williams and Kenny Steele or Williams with Kiki. Me personally, if I do it, I will go with Williams and Kiki. Alright guys, so let's jump to FD so I can give you guys my five players. For quarterback guys, I'm going to go with my team quarterback. It is 7.7 .7 and that is Josh Allen. Alright, Josh Allen is the guy I'm going to go with. I can't believe, you know, more is more expensive cheaper than Sam Dano. I just don't get that. But anyway, guys, Allen is the guy I'm gonna go with and I'm gonna pair him with Brown. Alright, so Allen never really he's just been very consistent, but he never really give you a game when he get over twenty five or twenty even twenty over twenty fantasy points. Alright. He never really been there, but this is the way to do it against that Philly team. You can run, you can pass, you can go deep. Just make sure you throw it to this guy I'm about to pick. And that will make me and the guys that follow me that choose this, those, those plays very, very happy. So John Brown, again, is the quarterback, is the quarterback receiver combo I'm going for. All right. So John Brown. For my running back guys basically I'm gonna go I mean let's go to running back real quick yeah Carson has been great Chubb is fine but he's playing New England he might not even be able to get to run the ball because New England gonna be so far ahead they, those guys are not supposed to be ahead of Fournette in prices no way no how you know so Fournette is the guy I'm gonna go ahead and play all right my other receiver I'm gonna go with is from the Giants. I'm gonna go with Tick, and that's Golden Tick. All right, I love Golden Tick too, but Golden Tick is the player I'm gonna go with. Right now, we don't know if Shepard is going to play. Um, most likely, might not play because of that concussion. That is like his second already. So the, the, for that reason, they might keep him out a little bit more. And Golden Tate gonna get as many targets as he's going to risk get, all right? And the only other player that's gonna get all those other targets that have left after Golden Tate will be his tight end, and that's why I'm gonna go ahead and pair him here. So basically, I will start with two teams, with the Giants, which is weird, but I like those two guys in there, regardless if they're gonna lose or not and with the bills so i'm gonna go with engram because engram is actually cheaper than all those guys up there and i don't like any of them except maybe for Waller, all right because of his and this guy getting a lot of targets but engram is the guy i'm going for i expect him to bounce this week all right so my five players are allen josh allen leonard hornet john brown golden tate and evan engram I love those. I just have to find the other players to mix them up and make a great lineup that will be somewhere up there in the winning positions. All right, guys. Good luck. Please, please, please subscribe. Share the lineup. Tweet it. Talk about my channel. Bring some other fantasy players to my channel. I really appreciate it. I'm trying to go to the channel. But, hey, for right now, that's fine too if they don't the little of us that choose it hopefully we can go ahead and earn some money without a lot of people coming to the channel but i still want it to be a biggest channel you know good luck guys hey i do video i do basketball video too i already have the basketball video video out right now check it out man i've been doing good so far for the for basketball so hopefully it's continue all right good luck
I appreciate you guys and let me end it with this little video. I mean, music video.